Hey folks, um, I went to a yard sale today here in Alabama and I thought I would go through and show you some of the goodies I bought. First, I'm going to work my way down the table. I got two of these Statue of Liberty um, mugs. We had two, I broke one, so now we have three. I have a friend who collects angels, so I got her this is like a stained glass. That was a little, kind of little angel Christmas tree ornament. And this is some kind of stained glass thing that goes on a stand. So I got her that. It looks like a stained glass window. And I got her this. It was a hand crocheted. And it's starch, so it's a like a Christmas tree chopper. I thought it was pretty. This is a little handmade um, box that's made out of like newsprint or um, magazines. It was 50 cents. It's rolled. It's um, shellac or something too. This is just a bag full of jewelry. I got a couple of silver um, rings, some crosses. A uh, nice little bracelet, and then this cute little bracelet with a skull on it. All of that was two dollars. This cute little um, glass, it's not a vase, bottle, glass bottle, it's 25 cents, it's red. And then here's another one that is just, um, I can make my kefir in this because it's got the French top. It was 50 cents. You have to have a heavy plastic thing to do that with. If you know what kefir is, you know what I'm talking about. This is just a red pashmina. It was a dollar. It's pretty. Or scarf, I guess. This cross is iron. It's 50 cents. I got this old used, I went to three different yard sales, so this is a compilation, I guess, of all three. I got this used um, Hershey's tin because I'm going to make a jelly plate, a heart-shaped jelly plate. I have a, let me go right here and get it. I have this plastic, old plastic thing I was going to use. But it doesn't have a lid on it, so I just knew the cats would get in it. I don't know if you can put gelatin in metal. It may rust. I don't know. But I won't use it very much. For as many uses as I want to get out of it, it'll be fine. I got this um, really sturdy spatula. I guess it's for the grill. But I'm going to use it in my taco bus. Got a pack of sheet protectors. These were a quarter. It's a brand new unopened pack. I got these. I got two of these. This is um, it's a it's a clear cover for a computer, but guess what I'm going to do with it? I think I can make a jelly plate out of it. Just like a little thin jelly plate. Turn it upside down. Put that cover on there. Keep the cats out of it. One was brand new. One was broken. And these were a quarter a piece. You know, I think I'll, I'll probably use this one. I got this. I don't know if you can see it or not. This is a, it's not metal, but it is really heavy. It looks old. It was a dollar. Happy, happy, happy. Just need two more and I'll have my say in. I got this neat box. It's a lacquer box. It has a drawer shelf in it. It was the most expensive thing. I think it was four dollars. I don't know if it's a jury box or just to put stuff in. I got a whole set of these um, new science encyclopedias for five dollars. There was like 20 of them I think. 20, 20 something. All for five dollars for my daughter's school. Then I got this anatomy poster or biology for her schooling. And then I got some neat frames. The first one I got looks like an old barnwood frame. It was two dollars. 
the second one I got is a tree. It's all engraved. This probably came from India or something. It was $2. And then my Bima's favorite one is a bottle cap frame. They just drilled holes in there and attached it with wire. I thought that was neat. I love that one. And then I got something free at a yard sale. I got copies of an old hymnal, church hymnal, that someone made copies of. She said she was a teacher, so she's probably a piano teacher. But um, those were free at the yard sale. So I can use those with my crafting and scrapping. So that was just a little quick uh, yard sale, Alabama yard sale haul. I hope y'all have a um, good weekend. And I'll have to try and find somewhere to put this. Someone made a comment that I look like a hoarder. This is my craft room. I'm going to be organizing the other side. These are the shelves that um, I bought $5. was that one that's got my printers on. I painted it turquoise. And then I paid $2 for that other stackable shelf for my stacks and my filing system. I just want to show you all that. And then that mess over there is my washi. i got to organize that. My washi tape. I bought that at um, Walmart. I think it was $17, $17 for those plastic things, which I hate. I'm going to try and find me another little tiny shelf to paint turquoise and put over there. So that's a little peek at my messy craft room. Yes, I'm a hoarder. I'm a crafter and an artist and a collector of all things. So I hope it doesn't offend anybody. Talk to you later. Just remember, use what you do what you can, use what you have, and be who you are. That's my new motto. Thanks, guys. Please like, subscribe, thumbs up if you like it. Bye-bye.